As of right now, I think in large scale lymphoma, um, car first, by specific second. I mean, <clears throat> I think based on the survival data we have with CAR, uh, CAR T, it's hard to move by specifics um, ahead of CAR T other than as a bridge without having a trial that actually compares the efficacy of the two in that patient population. Follicular lymphoma is a bit more in, um, ambiguous because again, uh, CAR-T is probably not curative or if it is cured, we don't know yet. Um, and because of the toxicity and the sort of the, the focus on quality of life of follicular lymphoma patients, I think you will have a bit of swapping where some people prefer bispecific, some people prefer CAR-T um, in that patient population. So we may get a lot of uh, at least early data about sequencing and then how one impacts the other, at least in follicular lymphoma. Whereas in large cell lymphoma, really we'll just see how bispecifics behave after CAR until we get more data. Um, we don't have bispecifics in other diseases, uh, so MCO, MZO, and Waldenstrom, so we don't really have that comparison as of yet. Um, but we'll have to wait and see. In the future, bispecifics will probably move into earlier lines of therapies as combination treatments. In large cell lymphoma, there are several studies that are ongoing which are combining bispecifics with CHOP or CHOP backbone. Um, and so we'll get information from that. And if those studies are positive, then ideally that'll move bispecifics in a frontline setting. And then we'll have the reverse of how, you know, exposure to a bispecific in a frontline impacts maybe CAR in second, third line setting. Uh, and the same is really happening in follicular lymphoma. I mean, there's a lot of combination studies looking at bispecifics plus Revlimid in a second line setting. And I suspect there'll be bispecifics in the frontline setting as well. Um, so really bispecifics because of their mobility will probably be in the future, of, you know, front, a first, a first line therapy in large cell lymphoma, first or second in follicular. And then we'll see with the other subsets as we get more data with bispecifics where they fall at.